I'm Karen with Shaker Heights Library. I'm here today to share an art project using shaving cream and food coloring. So what you're going to need for this project is a can of shaving cream, just regular shaving cream, food coloring, a spoon, a fork, some tweezers, lay down some newspaper, and you'll also need a pan and a piece of white copy paper, just regular copy paper. So the first thing you're going to want to do is take your shaving cream, you're going to shake it up, whoops, real good, and then you're going to want to spray some in the bottom of this pan. Once you do that, you take your spoon and you're going to smooth this out on the bottom of the pan. You just want to create a layer and make it as even as you can with a spoon. It doesn't have to be perfect. Spread it out. Okay. Once you've done that, put that down here on the newspaper, you're going to take your food coloring. I'm going to use blue and red. So we'll take the red first. And you just want to kind of go around and drop the food coloring on top of the shaving cream. It doesn't have to be in any particular pattern. Then you take the other color and do the same. Okay, that should be good. Now we're gonna take the fork that I told you about earlier and you're gonna kind of pull it through the colors and do like a wavy line. So you're kind of creating a um, design with the food color. I know it's not a very fun noise. Okay, okay that's good enough. Now we're gonna take our paper and we're gonna lay it on top all this. So push it down. I want to push down a little bit. And there you can see the food coloring is coming through the paper. And here's the science part of this. This is called absorption. When we put the food coloring in the shaving cream, the shaving cream absorbed the food coloring. And now that we've laid the paper on top, the paper is absorbing the food coloring as well. Push that down. You want to do this for about, I don't know, roughly 30 seconds. Okay, so now that we've done that, we're going to lift it up out of the pan. Here I'm going to use my tweezers. So lift it up, and you can see it's created a design on the paper. You're going to want to take a paper towel and kind of just blot it or wipe it to dry to get off the excess shaving cream. So there you have it. It created a really cool design. And each one you do is unique. And I can show you some examples of ones that I made. Here's one I made, another one, this one's blue and yellow. So you could either use these to make uh, wrapping paper to wrap small gifts, or as you can see here, I took one of them and filled it in half, you can make a card to give to a friend. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Have a great day.